Hello and welcome. Ready? Just start that three. Garth Massey, Josh Nelson. Good to meet you. Let's get it started. We should do a. We should do like a show out here. Yeah, we should. It'll be fun. Get it approved. Ladies and gentlemen, I'm Josh Nelson. I'm Garth Massey, and you are watching Grit live from the parking lot. Parking lot again. Pretend it's a pit. Let's get into it, Garth. Let's get right started. We've got our top ten reps from last week, and boy, was last week a great week. But it, let's first. It, re it re You know what? I think last week was a great week. It was a great week. Number 10 of veterans, we've got Zach Kinzel, 35 accounts, 40,852 in rev, absolutely crushing out in Cincinnati. Yeah, that's crazy. Jackson Curtis coming in at number nine, $42,015, 34 accounts. What a freak. No, nothing new. The nicest way possible. Yep. Alec Withers, 37 accounts from Chicago, $43,000 in rev, another amazing week by Brother Withers. Kayleen Johnson. Yep, one of the newest additions. At number seven, a vet. Mm -hmm. I, I thought at first she might be a rookie, but then I saw, I was like, that no. is crazy. Those are not rookie uh, numbers. It's not her that. first rodeo. Kayleen with $43,457 in revenue, 35 accounts. Unbelievable. Then you've got the Groat coming in at number six. Corbin Hansen, nothing new here as well. 34 accounts, 43,686 in total rev. Amazing good, week, Corbin. Great week. Uh, next, the guy you've uh, you've heard the name, you've seen him, uh, the Sarge, mm -hmm. Co Cody Olive, coming in number five, forty six thousand revenue on forty six accounts. What what a savage! Yeah, Cody Olive, his ramp is steep, and you are we're steep. we're all watching. Yeah. Next up, bad boy Jim James Fox, forty four accounts, just shy of fifty thousand dollars in revenue at forty nine four two five. Bad boy Jim is here, everybody, and he's here to stay. And he's being bad. And he's bad. He's bad. Bad man. And uh, next in number three, we got Brock Greed, $55,687 in revenue with 46 accounts. Making Brock a statement. has turned up like nothing we've ever seen before this year. He's always <laughs> been a freak and dominated, but Brock, this is just something else. 100%. Number two, this is a crazy one. Brother Adam Clark didn't even make the top 10 last week. He jumped into the number two spot with $56,748 with only, only mind you, 40 accounts. That's Not only, still a ton of accounts, but only just 40 accounts. <laughs> fat contract value. Uh, and the crazy thing is Adam Clark uh, also this past week passed his last year at a different company, summer total yeah. revenue last week in May and uh, so did so his compadre, Bailey, Stanley. So we still have three more weeks left. Three more months left of the summer. Yep. Yeah, that's crazy. I think he'll do more than he did last year. I don't see how he can't. Significant. I don't yeah, see how he can't. Done. <laughs> and, uh, and again, Bailey Stanley uh, coming from Anthem, both did it this Rushing past year. He's amazing. Yep. And our number one spot. Nothing new. Let him Nothing know. Nothing new. Brother Zachary Seeger, the heir, $57,616 in revenue of 48 accounts. Number one, looking to stay there. Let's move into the rookies. Number one on the charts. Number one in our heart, tied with a lot of other people we really love. But we love when Seager. it comes to production, that guy's right up there. Yep. Let's move on to the rookies, Garth. Uh, coming in number 10, we got last week at 16,448 on 11 accounts, Ike Nelson, yep. tearing it up. Next up at number nine, Ethan Belknap, $16,604 in revenue with 17 accounts. The ramp is real for these guys. It's real, it is mm -hmm. not imaginary, it, nope. it is a real thing. Uh, number eight, 18 accounts, 17,000 in revenue, Ori Cohen, yep. crushing it. Crushing it. Number seven, Jamar Rawls, $17,204 in revenue, 15 accounts. Yep. Ramping. And it's crazy, these next 15, 15, 14, 15, the revenue changes a little bit. It's a Just, lot of accounts. Yeah. Um, 15 accounts, 18,450. Number six, Matthew Dole. Crushing Amazing. it. Crushing it. Now we're into the 20K weeks. Uh, number five, Alexander Exler. 14 accounts, $20,712 in revenue. Yep. And, Insane. Uh, and uh, this next guy, number four, he's been on a few of these lists. Spencer Catalan mm -hmm. uh, coming in $20,934 with just 15 accounts. That's some fat deals Crazy. right there. Crazy. Tyler Brown, a name that we've seen quite a few times and I'm sure we will continue to see. $21,245 with 18 accounts. 21K. Some fat, fat deals right there. Yep. Too. 
and our guy, number two, Jack Fischetti. Straight 20, from Italy. To straight, he actually flew to area from the lawn. <laughs> yeah. And uh, Jack Fischetti, $23,633 on 20 accounts, taking the number two spot last week for the rookies and our top guy. And it's not close, again, Jacob Griffith, 28 accounts. Thirty thousand two hundred and ten dollars. Six. Jacob Griffith. Six thousand and change above between that. one and two. It's crazy, Jacob. Unbelievable. Keep, Top teams. Keep going it. Top two. Let's just skip this. These guys don't care about that. No, no, no. It doesn't matter at this point. I don't it only matters care. during the rumble. We'll just go to like <laughs> something different. Number ten with eleven thousand six sixty eight. We've got Dover, Delaware. Those dirty dogs out there. The dirty Delaware dogs down in <laughs> South Dover, mm -hmm. getting it, getting it done. Uh, number nine, we've got uh, Cincinnati. 11,751. Crushing it. Zach Kinsel leading that squad out there. Then you've got in the south of Jersey, mm -hmm. 11,807. That's Cody Olive and the boys out there. Yep. Next at seven, $11,887. We've got the Austin OKC squad. Yep. Coming in number seven. Currently in Austin, looking to move here in the next couple months. Uh, next up, we've got Chicago, 12,653. Chicago absolutely turning up. Kanye would love hearing about that. He would. He'd probably, he'd probably rap about just it. Just shoot him a text or something. Mm -hmm. Okay, uh, next we've got Tyler, Texas in the number five spot, 13,460 on average per rep on the week in revenue. Next up, Louisville, 14,433. Your, your birthplace, as I learned last, last week. That is true. <laughs> it is not a lie. Uh, <laughs> great place. And in third, we got Des Moines. Mm -hmm. Some people call it Des Moines. But they don't know how to read no, very well. French. And uh, 14,609 Des Moines, number three. Next, Unbelievable. Next up, up north, in the north of Jersey. Yep. 14,838. Seeger and the boys up there crushing it. And again, it's something about this number two to number one jump. There's a significant bump here. From just under 15,000, jumping up to our number one spot, over 20,000, 20,518. The number one team last week. You know this place. You love this place. Love I love this place too. Grand Rapids. Grand Rapids, baby. Amazing place. Done. Jake Shear, Hudson Ash, crap. Everybody. I got uh, awesome job. You know, are there even rapids there? Yes, they're White River Rapids, and that's where the name comes from, folks. <laughs> I hope that you know, uh, just like I did and do, that there are rapids there, mm -hmm. and uh, they are flowing. And they're grand. Heavily. Uh, right now with that team up there let's guys. Let's uh, let's move on to something as you can see here uh, Let's remove the hat just for a moment of uh, respect to uh, In actual seriousness. Yes, we're incredibly grateful for uh, everybody in the military that has and is serving and uh, It's great to be able to celebrate doing the thing. We love best uh, ripping Sorry. deals. So guys last uh, yesterday yesterday yep. last day before today uh, We had 35 Actually, I believe this is technically, I think it was 37 reps over $10,000 in revenue. Now, I'll have you know, we just did shy of 2 million. It was like 1.85. Yep, 1. 1. 8 something. yep, which is insane. But uh, there were, uh, you know, we follow a couple other companies just to see like, you know, what like, How we stack what, like up. fun things that they're kind of doing while cute. we're working in the summer. That's cute. And uh, one of them, their top rep did 7,300 in revenue. Um, we had, I think I, I ran it, it was like 74 reps that would have been the top rep at that company. Um, and uh, that's pretty crazy. Crazy, 35 over 10K. Have, is that chicken mox, pox? What is it, Chicken Moxie? Poxy? I forget. Anyway. That, that was the worst joke you've ever told. We don't want to mention who it was. <laughs> okay, okay uh, 35 reps over 10K. Then we had 17 reps over 12K. Yep. Hit us with that next one. Uh, nine over 15K and one did something that I don't believe has ever been done in the history of pest control. Claimed to have been one, done once, but we'll see. One over 30K. You know who you are and we'll get right into that. But you guys, awesome job yesterday. Hopefully you guys had a great time. Hopefully you've broken. It's a fun day. It's a fun day, dude. The punch, the vibes, it's unreal. We had to like, when we were posting all the stories, like like break up the amount of like caffeine intake. It was a little, it was, it was a little aggressive intense. when you see it so, all at once. But great work. We'll be so rolling fun. this into Shattered Glass, which Josh will be talking about in just one second. But let's head over to Grit Reaper. Grit Reaper, the rookie still stands. Spencer Catalan is still the rookie, uh, still the Grit Reaper in the rookie status. Last week, however, 
Veteran Hudson Ashcraft serviced $16,124 in a day. The new vet number, Hudson, great work. That was actually last Pretty week. I, forgot, I didn't frankly. include him, so that was on me. But the pro that beat it and continues to beat it and is the man, Drew Hansen, the undisputed goat of the industry. A lot of, a lot of people were saying he wasn't that good, but after yesterday, I think that they may have changed their mind. $31,448 in one day, That's, 22 accounts. It's sickening a little bit. Gosh, yeah. Drew, congrats, but I said. Will, will that be beaten? Did I, I, I told you 30 would be done. But People will, laughed will, at me. Will 31,448 be beaten this summer? I actually don't know. That's one that I'm pretty, uh, I don't know. Well, For, folks, time will tell, I we'll guess. We'll find out. All right, next up. Moving forward, so guys, yesterday, hopefully you all had an amazing time crushed it, had your biggest days like so many of you did. Uh, but that's the first day moving into this week's competition, which is Shattered Glass. Uh, shattered Glass, as you know, uh, references the ceiling that we put on ourselves. And uh, it's time to break it. It's time to shatter, shatter, shatter that bad boy. So this week we have uh, different requirements that including Monday, moving through the entire thing, you'll win these prizes if you hit these numbers. Uh, so we've got, for the rookies, 25 account minimum. Mm -hmm. Veterans, 35 accounts. And pros, 60 accounts. What are they gonna win, Garth? So if they, if a rookie gets 25, vet 35, pro 60, you win one, an exclusive t-shirt for shattering the glass ceiling, and two, concert. Shatterproof. Shatter protectant. Yes. Sure, yes. Uh, concert tickets, $500 concert tickets of your choice. Go to any concert you want, you'll get 500 bucks to do it. So awesome. next up, who this- gonna, Who are you gonna see, Garth? You, see, you win that, who do you go to? Uh, I might have to see Morgan Wallen again. He's good. Yeah. Or my boy, JB. Yeah. Uh, let's move on to next week, Garth. We have some fun yeah. stuff. Why don't you tell the folks what fun stuff we have next week? Yep, this Saturday, we've got Grit or Die round five. The prize is Grit Akomi sunglasses, everybody. Currently, 75 rookies, 35 veterans, and 15 pros are still in the competition to compete this Saturday. Moving on and winning the sunglasses will be the top 25 rookies, top 15 vets, and top 10 uh, pros. That being said, all these numbers are found in the old leaderboard underneath the Grit or Die tab. Yep. Of those that are eliminated already though, you still have a chance. You, you can still, still win, win some something. Stuff. Yeah, something. This week, the top 10 rookies, or sorry, Saturday, top 10 rookies, 10 vets, three pros can all win the pickleball paddle from last week, the one that has made me a substantially better pickleball player. Uh, that may have worked for Garth. We will not guarantee your game improves. In fact, uh, the adjustment from paddle to paddle may- Actually tax you. May, may tax you at first, but then you'll get better, probably. And this next week, everybody, we are introducing the GFC, which stands for? The Grit Fight Club. But this next week, starting Monday, we first have this seating round. We want to make sure that we have the best versus the best. So what that looks like, we will be having 14 rookie divisions. In each of these divisions, there are 12 reps. One dozen reps per division. Per division. So we got 14 rookie divisions. 10 veteran divisions and two pro divisions. Now, a lot of people say, well, why don't I just seed into a lower division so that I can win some cool prizes in a lower division? Oh, well, we thought about that. Yeah, we thought about that. We're not, it's not gonna happen, not on our watch, no the, way. And this is why. If you seed into the first division, rookie, veteran, and pro, you win some Nike lost and found Jordan 1s. They are sick. Yeah, they really the red brought colorway. those things back. They're great. You're, you're, or, if you don't have these, you need these. You need them. Or a 70 inch TV. If you seed into Division 2 in Rookie, Veteran, or Pro, you win a Theragun, a grit branded Theragun. We did these last year. Absolutely unreal. Now, Division 3, you win a brand new pair of AirPod Pros, the new ones. Division 4, a Whoop Band. That way you can keep track of your sleep, your exercise. If I've you been want, trying to track my exercise, you, and I. You should. I haven't been exercising because I don't have one. It would be a waste. You need a whoop band. So, I mean, you know. I'll get you one. Uh, if you see it into Division 5, okay. an Essential Hoodie. Essentials. Hoodie. Uh, 6, a JBL Pulse 4. You have one. It's amazing. It's great. Lights, loud, you know. The whole nine yards. Fun, everything. And 7 through 14, right? So, if you are, if you see it into Division, or the Rookie Division, 7 through 14, or Veteran, 7 through 10, you'll win a Custom Grit Thread Bag. And these are sick. Yep. We'll design it with thread. It's going to be absolutely unreal. Now, that being said, those are the prizes that you want to win. That's why you want to seed because every single one of the people that seed into those um, seed into those divisions will win it. So we will be giving away 12 pairs of lost and founds to all the vets, 12 pairs of lost and founds to the veteran or to the pros and 12 to the rookies. 
so on and so forth. Going to be unreal. Lost and found and won. And won. And that, uh, that's going to be coming up. So that's going to be incredibly fun. Now, uh, as we remember, we made a bet. You said that nobody would do. Can we, can we cut? I think that we're done. You said that uh, if somebody, I, I knew that somebody was going to do over 30K in a day. I didn't know when this was going to happen. I thought it would be down the road. Little did I know it would be literally five days after you said it wouldn't be done. Uh -huh. So what we have here is a delicious blueberry pie that will be going in your face. I am hungry. <laughs> so get ready. Okay. <laughs> well, folks, at least it tastes good. And, uh, let's, have another, let's have another great week. Let's have a better week than my face is having right now. So, uh, Wait, close stay, it. Close stay tuned for... Another great week. Something like this next week, but the dark. Thanks for being with us.